Hi, Big Tractor Power fans. This video comes to you from a rye field located in east central Wisconsin, where a 220 engine horsepower, 204 bushel storage capacity John Deere 9550 combine is harvesting the crop. This rye has been swathed and is being harvested with a 12 foot wide John Deere pickup platform. During the video, we'll take a look at this combine's production history, specifications, and original price tag. But first, let's head out to the field so that you can see and hear all this harvesting action. The rye in this video being harvested by the John Deere 9550 has been swathed. Here we can see a John Deere 800 wind rower working in Wisconsin cutting wheat. This wind rower is used to speed up the harvest and the dry time of the grain. Often winter wheat or rye will still have a green stem, but the grain is almost ready to harvest. By cutting it and wind rowing it, the farm speeds up the drying time and starts the harvest a little bit earlier. John Deere introduced the new 50 series range of combines for model year 2000. This was the largest selection of combines offered by the company to that date. There were six new 50 series machines, which included two rotary STS combines, a CTS small grain and rice special combine, and three traditional cylinder walker combines. The model 9550 is the mid-range combine in the 50 series straw walker lineup, which starts with the 190 horsepower, 182 bushel, four straw walker model 9450, and is led by the 275 horsepower, 240 bushel, five straw walker model 9650. The 9550 is powered by an 8.1 liter John Deere Powertech 496 cubic inch engine rated at 220 engine horsepower. It's fitted with a 150 gallon diesel fuel tank and features a three speed hydrostatic transmission. This combine was built with a 55 inch wide feeder house and a 26 inch diameter threshing cylinder. It has a total cleaning area of 6,370 square inches. It is a four straw walker machine. The straw walkers help separate the grain from the straw and chaff. It has a total separating area of 9,703 square inches. The 9550 is fitted with a 204 bushel grain tank. 
that unloads at 2.2 bushels per second through a 21-foot unloading auger. When this combine was new, rolling off the assembly line in East Moline, Illinois, it weighed in at 23,232 pounds. It was manufactured from model year 2000 through 2003 and had an original price tag of $155,393 when it was new. The John Deere 9550 is picking up the windrows of rye with a John Deere 212 belt pickup. This header was manufactured from 1979 through 1988 by John Deere and was compatible with every combine of the era from the Model 4400 up to the 8820. The original price tag for this 12-foot belt pickup header was $6,230 when it was new. I hope that you've enjoyed spending some time out in the field with this John Deere 9550 combine harvesting rye. I would like to hear in the comment section below this video, if you use a John Deere combine on your farm, tell me about the crops that you're harvesting with it. If you've enjoyed the content in this presentation, consider subscribing to Big Tractor Power YouTube, where there's over 2,000 videos of farm machines in action. If you would like to see additional videos featuring combines harvesting small grains, continue to watch for a few more seconds to the end screen for a direct link to more Big Tractor Power YouTube videos. As always, thank you for watching.